Here's a little good news. Lotus RC just sent me their newest flight controller. It says 3S on it, new FC. Okay, so this is the flight controller for T580P Plus. Yes. And here is the newest ESC from Lotus RC for which they say there will be no more ESC burning problems, there will be no more flip of deaths. So you can see now that before there used to be lots of lots of how to say chips, very strange kind of chips uh, soldered very looks like by hand or something but now the only chips are here on the back which are for sure the ICs but on the front I see a big nice heat sink on MOSFETs I think hmm. great uh, I wish they added a fan on it as well that would actually do much more cooling for this one but again hey this is the new ESC for <clears throat> Lotus RC T580P Plus and this one can take maximum five cell batteries this means I'll be using it to fly with 4S batteries I just need to confirm this 3S here doesn't mean 3S battery current coming to this one or 4S current will burn this one so after confirming I'm gonna put this one in my T580P Plus and give it a flight Forty-three degrees centigrade uh, motor. I will put it this way. Motor is twenty-seven. That's motor one. Motor two twenty-nine. Motor three twenty-five. And motor four thirty. So basically, we have tons of power now, and that's only three S battery. Imagine using 4S or 5S LiPoly, this thing will give us some sweet power. So uh, this was indoor flight, I will bring it to uh, uh, outdoors and uh, put our camera on it, like give it some payload and then we will give it an outdoor flight and see how it's behaving and if there is any more issues of this bugger burning. New flight controller, ah, I'm loving the stability it's offering now. 
uh, I don't know if it is a new flight controller or it's uh, just an upgraded one I have to confirm with uh, Lotus RC so according to Lotus RC we can start selling the T580P plus again but with a little increased cost because of the new ESC here so uh, I'll release the info information very very soon the new cost of T580P plus and uh, we will start selling last but not least the motors have been fixed as well before when we are tightening the propellers okay if you over tighten the propeller it will pull the shaft up and and motor will go really hard which will make the ESC burn or get hot so now that problem is fixed as well but again it is recommended when the propeller is uh, tightened do not over tighten it move the propeller until it stops moving tighten a just tiny bit and then put the propeller cap with uh, uh, with not hot glue with the Loctite definitely with the Loctite okay so uh, we'll take it out and see how it's behaving I'm loving the performance at home for now and here it is the T580P plus with upgraded ESC new ESC and the upgraded or new flight controller so this is the final uh, so this is the final version and you can see my stick and fly plug and play FPV combo is right there let me give you a closer look. And you can see that with our stick and fly FPV combo, it is just piece of cake to actually bend this plate, which is very soft, easy to bend, and set it up any way you like on any aircraft. That is why we call our FPV combos stick and fly. This means that means you just stick it anyway anywhere on your aircraft and start flying FPV in no time at all so not only plug and play but also stick and fly so side view you can see this soft metal bar or metal plate that we provide is easy to bend any way you want to fix your stick and fly FPV combo supplied by onlyflyingmachines.com or by us and start flying FPV in no time at all so T580P plus is now ready it's more powerful it's more agile it's more stable with new ESC I'm gonna give it a flight with 3S then I'm gonna give it a flight with 4S and we will see the power the performance and flight time and see if there are any issues in it